What's up guys, it's Drax here. Today I'm going to be bringing you guys another top 5 female chart alpha video. This will be the first alpha that I'm going to show you on how to make. So whenever you do make it to a clothing store, just go over here to the top section, scroll down until you find sweaters, which will be on slot 39 or on slot 41, and you're going to look for the beige turtleneck, which will be right here on, I believe, slot 92. So you're going to go ahead and equip the beige turtleneck. After you have done this, back out of sweaters, scroll up until you find overcoats and overcoats will be right here on slot 18 and look for the gray cashmere coat on slot 52. After you do equip the beige turtleneck and the gray cashmere coat, you can then just back out of the tops, head over here to the pants, scroll down to suit pants, which will be on slot six or on slot five. And you're going to equip the black fitted shiny pants on slot 20 on slot 28. After you do equip the black fitted shiny pants, go over here to your accessories, scroll down to gloves on slot 10 and equip the black tactical gloves on slot 72. When you do equip these gloves, that will be all for the accessories. So go over here to the shoes, scroll down to canvas shoes, which will be on slot five and look for the black canvas on slot 10. After you do equip the black canvas, this will be the last accessory. So just go over here to your hats, go to combat helmets on slot 23 and equip the black quad lens on slot 45. After you do equip the black quad lens, that will be all for the head accessories. Now we're going to go ahead and equip the body armor. So to do this, pull up your interaction menu, go to inventory, go to body armor and go to your show armor and set it to the standard armor, which is this black vest right here. And after you do that, that's pretty much it. So if you guys are wondering what the outfit looks like at the pot in the pause menu, here you guys go. Pretty cool gray and black outfit for your female character. But after you do make it, you can then just walk up here to the front counter. Hit edit saved outfits and save the outfit on any slot that you want. So yeah, that's pretty much it. So now after you do save it, we can move on to the second female outfit. This will be the second outfit that I'm going to show you on how to make. So for this outfit, head back over here to your tops once again. Scroll down until you find bust ears, which will be on slot 52. And equip the red heart lace bust ear on slot 5. Whenever you have done this, back out, go over here to your pants. Scroll down to arena war pants on slot 17 and look for the black and red leather stitch pants on slot 23. After you do equip these arena war pants, just go over here to your accessories and scroll down to cuffs, which will be on slot 11. And you're gonna look for the black gauntlet for your left arm, which will be on slot 17. And if you scroll down to slot 31, you're gonna equip the black gauntlet for your right arm. After you do equip the cuffs back out, go to gloves on slot 10 and equip the black fingerless gloves on slot 56. So I almost did forget one thing. So after you do have the black fingerless gloves, scroll up to the top, which will be on slot four, click on scarves, and you're gonna equip the red tassel scarf on slot nine. After you do have the cuffs, the gloves, and the scarf, that will be all for the accessories. So just go over here to the shoes, scroll down to arena war shoes on slot 16, and equip the black and red lineups on slot 37. After you, have done, after you have done this, you can now go over here to the hats. But before we do go into the hats, you're going to want to equip the rebreather. So to equip the rebreather, pull up your interaction menu, go to style, go to your accessories, and on gear, scroll one time to the right like this, and you'll see that your character equips the rebreather. If you guys don't have the rebreather, then you will want to go to a gun store, go to the middle counter where it says gear, and then you guys will see your earpieces, the night vision goggles, and then at the bottom, it's going to be the rebreather. After you do equip the rebreather on your character or buy it, and it does equip on your character, go back to the clothing store, head over here to the hats, scroll down to caps backwards, and you're going to look for the vapid cap on slot three, which will be this one. It should look like this. After you do that, it should combine with the rebreather. And the final part that we're going to add is the parachute. So, so to do this, pull up your interaction menu, go to style, go to your parachute, say your parachute to on and have it set to the black combat shoe bag. If you don't have the black combat shoe bag, you will need to head back to the gun store, go up to the front counter, go to parachute, go to parachute bags, and then just look for the black combat shoe bag. After you do buy it, you can then back out of the front counter, pull up your interaction menu, go to style, go to your parachute and set it to on, and it will be set to the black combat shoe bag. After that, that's pretty much it. If you are wondering what it does look like in the pause menu, here you guys go. Pretty cool outfit. If you guys like RNG, this would be a nice RNG outfit to make. But yeah, that's pretty much it for the outfits. Now you can walk up here to the front counter, hit edit saved outfits and save the outfit on any slot that you want. Once you have saved it, we can now move on to the third outfit. So for the third outfit, this is gonna be the outfit I'm gonna show you how to make. So just head over here to your tops for the third time, scroll down until you do find leather jackets on slot five 
and equip the black leather field jacket on slot 57. Whenever you have done that, that, that will be all for the tops. So just walk over here to the pants, scroll down to suit pants on slot five and equip the black fitted shiny pants on slot 28. After you do equip the suit pants, you can now walk over here to your accessories, go to gloves, which will be on slot 10 and equip the black leather gloves on slot 60. After you do equip these gloves, that will be all for the accessories. So go over here to the shoes, scroll down to sneakers on slot three and look for the black plain high tops, which will just be on slot three. Now you can back out of your shoes. Before we go into the hats, this is just gonna be like the last outfit, just equip the rebreather first. So to do this, pull up your interaction menu, go to style, go to your accessories, scroll through your gear once, just hit right on your D-pad once and you'll see that it does equip the rebreather. If you don't have the rebreather, go to a gun store, go to the middle counter where it says gear and then it'll show you your earpiece, the night vision goggles and then at the bottom it's gonna be the rebreather. Go ahead and buy the rebreather. Once you have bought the rebreather, then you can just back out of the counter and then just head back to the clothing store, go to hats, scroll down to bulletproof helmets on slot 20 and equip the black bulletproof and you should see that it does merge together just like this. And that's pretty much it for the outfit. Now you can walk up here to the front counter, hit edit saved outfits and save the outfit on any slot that you want. Once you have saved it, we can now move on to the fourth female outfit. Okay guys, this will be the fourth outfit that I'm going to show you on how to make. For this outfit, just head over here to your tops once again, scroll down until you find sweaters on slot 41, click on sweaters, and equip the gray turtleneck on slot 97. Once you have equipped the gray turtleneck, back out of sweaters, scroll down to the bottom until you do find utility vest on slot 62, and equip the ash plate carrier on slot 51. Whenever you have done that, and you have equipped the gray turtleneck and the ash plate carrier, you can now back out of the tops, Head over here to your pants, scroll down to leggings, which I believe will be right here on slot 10, and equip the gray sparse camo leggings on slot 32. Whenever you have done this, back out of the pants, head over here to your accessories, scroll down to gloves on slot 10, and equip the gray fingerless gloves on slot 55. The gloves will be all for the accessories, so go over here to your shoes, click on boots on slot one, and look for the charcoal winter boots on slot 62. Once you have equipped these charcoal winter boots, head over here to your hats, go to bulletproof helmets on slot 20 and equip the charcoal bulletproof. After you have equipped the charcoal bulletproof, the final accessory is gonna be the parachute. So to, pull, to equip the parachute, pull up your interaction menu, go to style, go to your parachute, set it to on and have it set to the black combat shoe bag. If you don't have the black combat shoe bag, go to a gun store, go to the front counter, go to parachute, go to parachute bags and then just buy the black combat shoe bag after you do buy the black combat shoe bag, back out, pull up your interaction menu, go to style, go to your parachute, set it to on, and it will be set to the black combat shoe bag. And after you make that, that's pretty much it for the outfit. So if you are wondering what it does look like in the pause menu, here you guys go. Pretty cool winter outfit. So after you've made this outfit, you can now walk up here to the front counter, hit edit saved outfits, and save the outfit on any slot that you want. After you've saved the outfit, we can now move on to the fifth female outfit. So for the final outfit, you're going to want to walk up here to the front counter, scroll down until you do find the highest tactical stealth on slot 17, and you're going to equip the operative outfit because it gives you the boots and these pants. If you guys try to, for some reason, equip a certain pair of pants and then try to go to the shoes and equip those, these boots, it doesn't let you. I don't know why. That's just how Rockstar made it. But after you've equipped the operative outfit, you can now go ahead and back up to the front counter, head over here to your tops. Scroll down until you do find Tuck t-shirts, which will be on slot 28, and equip the Black Classic on slot 11. After you've equipped the Black Classic t-shirt, back out of the Tuck t-shirts, scroll down to slot 62, which will be Utility Vest, and you're going to equip the Dark Green Armor on slot 65 once you do get to Utility Vest. So that will be all. So after you do equip the Black Classic and the Dark Green Armor, you can now back out of the tops, head over here to your pants. Now for the pants... You're just going to scroll down to suit pants, which will be on slot five and equip the black fitted shiny pants on slot 28. So after you do equip the black fitted shiny pants, just head over here to your accessories, scroll down to scarves on slot four and equip the black tassel scarf on slot 22, which will be all the way at the bottom. Whenever you've done this back out of scarves, scroll down to gloves on slot 10 and you're going to look for the black fingerless gloves on slot 56. After you've equipped the black fingerless gloves, go to cuffs on slot 11. And for your left arm, you're going to equip the skull wrist chain, which will be on slot 21. And if you scroll down to slot 33, you're going to equip the gear wrist chain for your right arm. 
And after you do have the scarf, the gloves, and the cuffs, that's going to be all for the accessories. So just head over here to the hats, go to Bulletproof Helmets Onslaught, tw Onslaught 20, and equip the Forced Bulletproof. After you've equipped the Forced Bulletproof, the final accessory for this outfit is going to be over here at the mask door. So I will get back to you once I have made it to the mask door. Now that you have made it to the mask door, just walk over here to the mask, go to Ski Mask on slot 16, and equip the Black Tie Ski on slot 114. After you do equip the Black Tie Ski, it should merge with the Bulletproof Helmet just like this. And that's pretty much it for the outfit. So now you can just go over here to the tops or the clothing store and hit Edit Saved Outfits and save the outfit on any slot that you want. And after you do save the outfit, that's pretty much it. So I hope you guys did enjoy these five female outfits. So I hope you guys did enjoy. Please like and subscribe. Thank you guys for watching. Peace.